A middle-aged patient, the managing director of a marketing company here in Frankfurt, came to my practice because he was bothered by the class 5 defects on tooth 2.4 and 2.5. To expose the preparation margins, a cord size 0 was placed in the sulcus. I used the Venus Pearl Shade Guide for shade selection and chose A3 as the basic shade in this case. In order to improve the adhesion, as well as the optical characteristics in the transition area of the composite and the tooth substance, I used a fine grain diamond tool to prepare the enamel. I-bond etch was then applied to the tooth surface, beginning on the enamel and continuing towards the dentine. After the corresponding application time, the tooth was rinsed off thoroughly and then dried, so that some residual moisture was retained on the surface. In accordance with the etch and rinse technique, I-bond total etch was applied to the tooth surface. This product does not need any agitation. After the corresponding application time, air was blown on the material, beginning at the enamel and moving towards the dentine until an even glossy surface is achieved, which was then light cured for 20 seconds. On tooth 2.4, I began with shade OM, or opaque medium, of the flowable nano hybrid composite Venus Diamond Flow. It was placed at the center of the cavity in order to create a shade-intensive structure. Once light curing had been completed, I added further layers of Venus Diamond Flow A3. Using the probe, the material was carefully adapted to the preparation margins and light cured accordingly. For final modeling, I once again used A3 to cover the entire cavity. For tooth 2.5, I used the Nano Hybrid Composite Venus Pearl. Here, the opaque shade OMC was also placed at the center of the cavity and slowly adapted to the margin. The tooth was built up with two layers of A3 and the filling completed. I used an oscillating diamond instrument for finishing. The probe was used to verify the filling areas. Pre-polishing was then performed with the pink Venus Supra pre-polishers using low pressure and water spray. The gray high gloss polisher from the same system was then used to polish the filling to a high gloss. I removed the cords and verified the filling in terms of aesthetic integration. To sum up, both flowable and higher viscous composite enable the creation of highly aesthetic class 5 fillings. The patient was just as satisfied and left the practice happy with the result.